Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Aditi's Crochet. So today I am here with this beautiful bow which I am going to use as a clip and you can use this in any of your projects as a bow. You can use this in your frocks, you can use this as, as a hair clip also and uh, you can use this, use this bow in any of your project. If you want it little bit bigger or smaller, just decrease the chains that I have made in this. So let's begin. Let's begin. To begin with, I am taking this my leftover yarn and I will make a X like this and then I will make a magic knot. So make a magic knot like this, make a cross, then insert like this and pull this yarn and then like this my magic ring is ready. Now make 6 chains. Two, three, four, five, and six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So my six chains are ready. Then we will make six double treble crochets in this ring. So what is double treble crochets? Take the yarn three times in your hook, insert in the magic ring, and pull. Then I have five in my hook. Pull through two, pull through two, pull through two, and then pull through two. So like this, my first double treble stitches ready. Then again, take the yarn three times, one, two, three, and then make it a double treble crochet. So I have five in my hook, pull through two, pull through two, pull through two, sorry and pull through two so like this we are going to make six double triple crochets in this magic ring i will show you once more one two three times insert in the magic ring like this and take the yarn then pull through two pull through two pull through two and pull through two so like this make six double treble crochets here i will make two after making my six double treble crochets now look like this my six double treble crochets are ready then the next step is chain of five one two three four five and then make a slip knot in this magic ring so making a slip knot like this and like this one part of my bow is ready make it a little bit tighter like this then to start with the next part making chain five again one two three four five and like this part we will again make six double treble crochets so taking the yarn three times in your hook insert in the magic ring pull and then i am having five in my hook so pull through two pull through two pull through two and pull through two again one two three times insert in the magic ring i have five in my hook pull through two pull through two then pull through two and pull through two so like this complete your six double treble crochets here also one two three insert in the magic ring take the yarn pull through two pull through two pull through two and pull through two again make it a little bit closer then again one two three and insert in the magic ring pull through two pull through two so if once we you, you will know the pattern of this bow it's only just i think five minutes or your speeds depend that you can make it only in i think uh, five minutes only or maybe if you are slower or you are a beginner then you will take 10 minutes not more than that so i am done with my four double treble crochets one more like this pull through two pull through two 
pull through two pull through two now on my last one i have five then one two and three then insert in the magic ring pull pull through two pull through two pull through two and pull through two so like this both sides of my uh, this uh, bow is ready but now what we have to do is to complete this side we will chain five one two three four five and we will make a slip knot in this magic ring so making a slip knot over here and like this like this bow is ready now lose it a little bit and then take this yarn which we have taken in beginning and close this little hole of the magic ring pull it as much as tighter you can then what i will do is i will cut this yarn like this and then i will make a slip knot like this like this and again pull it little bit tighter as much as you can now to finish it and to give we give it a finish touch what we have to do is i will make it like this and then again the last the second end i will make a finish touch like this like this then i will take my hook and pass it from this to this side and again from this to this side and then make a knot over here also and take my hook and take my yarn like this and make it a little bit tighter and then you can cut this yarn like this like this so my bow is ready like this now you can take clip of your choice which you want to have a smaller one or bigger one so like this my bow is pretty this you can use as a hair clip or this you can use uh, make it and uh, put it over a dress or anything you want to make so i hope you you will like this video and you will subscribe to my channel and give me a thumbs up please subscribe to my channel thank you